with it is with teeth cleaning. We give the robot its first action, then we put it in automatic mode. So it will start teeth cleaning first. It does it quarter by quarter. Okay. Uh, the teeth cleaner, there's only one. Mm -hmm. So the teeth cleaner itself is completely separate from the rest of the milking module. So your okay. first milk that comes out in any wash water does not contaminate the good milk going to the bulk. Makes sense. Yep, so. and you're looking at about two minutes from the start of teeth cleaning to the time milking actually starts. Wow. Average stall time anywhere between six minutes, 30, and seven minutes. Yeah. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, the milking machines these days, it's come a long way from a, certainly has. <laughs> a bucket and a milk and a cow, jeez. That's right. That's crazy. And you also see that at the top, you've got the camera with lasers that flash. Mm. That helps in identifying that it is a teeth there. Yeah. First time a cow ever comes into the robot, you have to teach her. You've got a joystick here. You basically yeah. teach the robot where the teeth positions are, and then it sends it onto the hard drive, and it will always use that as a reference. Okay, and then kind of goes from there as a rough exactly. idea. Each, yeah. each successful time that the cow comes into the robot and has a successful attachment, yeah. it will re-update its teeth positions. Yeah. So it always has a reference button with the shop. And then once the first cup is on, milking starts, so you see flow right away on that board. Oh wow. That's really cool. So we don't wait until our all four are attacked. Another advantage for that about doing quarter milking is that if ever you have a kickoff, so she steps on one of the hoses it falls off. Yeah. Instead of milk instead of stopping milking on the other quarters, yeah. it'll just stop that one quarter that's fallen off. Wow. Retracts the cup into the magazine. Disinfects the cup. Yeah. Arm goes back, grabs it, reattaches it. So, for example, she just stepped on it. She kicked it off. Yeah. See the arm come back. We see it get retracted. It goes back and gets it and reattaches and reattaches. Again, I don't have the cleaning turned on, but that's something that you can turn on. Yeah, on. yeah. But it all depends on on what you prefer. Mm hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Other advantage of quarter milking is that you will never over milk one quarter over the other yeah. because of flow rates. As soon as it drops below, depending on what you have set, usually seventy percent. Yep. If the flow drops below that, it will start retracting quarter by quarter. Wow, cool. Do you have any problems with the robot getting caught in the cords? Uh, the arm, you mean? Yeah. So the arm. No. No. No, because of that camera around, it's able to navigate that. Yeah. Hmm. You said how long is it? Two minutes before when it's from when it starts. From start of cleaning to the point that all four milkers are attached to start milking, yeah. you're looking at about two minutes. Wow! And then another four and a bit to finish the milking. Process. Yeah, does it in quarters too? Yep. Oh, interesting. Just retracts them back in there as well. That's it. Wow! Nice.